Thank you for tuning in to Terry Swoop videos. On today's video, I'm gonna talk about the legendary music producer and singer, Sylvia Robinson. Now, for those of you younger people who don't know who Sylvia Robinson is, Sylvia Robinson is known as the mother of hip hop. She's known as the first record producer to bring hip hop to the mainstream. She started her own record label, Sugar Hill Records, in 1979 and when she signs the group the sugar hill gang they release rappers delight and the song becomes hugely successful and it sells platinum and this song is what brought rap music to the mainstream before 1979 most rap music was just looked at as an underground fad that was played at block parties but when she signs the Sugar Hill Gang and they release Rapper's Delight, this is what brought rap music to the mainstream. And then in 1982, she releases The Message with The Furious Five. And that was also hugely successful. Now, Sylvia Robinson was born on May 29th, 1935 in Harlem, New York. Her parents were immigrants from the Virgin Islands. And she started performing as an artist in the 1950s. She started out in this R&B group called Mickey and Sylvia. And they had a lot of success singing together between the late 1950s and 1960s. Love is Strange was their biggest hit as a duo. She ends up going solo in the early 1970s. And she releases the popular song Pillow Talk. Pillow Talk sold, sells over a million copies and it makes it to the top five on the Billboard charts of the Hot 100. And she has a lot of success throughout the 1970s as a solo artist. And like I said earlier in the video, she starts her own record company in 1979 called Sugar Hill Records. And this record company is what brought rap music to the mainstream. If it wasn't for Sugar Hill Records, there would be no rap music today. There would be no such thing as hip hop in the mainstream. It would probably just be looked at as a taboo underground form of music. But instead, it's the most popular music nowadays that's played on the airwaves. And it all started with Sugar Hill Records. And this is why Sylvia Robinson is known as the mother of hip hop. Because if it wasn't for her, a lot of these rappers who are making millions of dollars that are having all this success would not be having this success if it wasn't for her. Now, at, over the last 30 years, she's written dozens of songs. She's worked with dozens of different artists with R&B and hip hop. And she's known as a legend in the history of black music. Sylvia Robinson was married to Joseph Robinson from 1959 until his death in 2000. They had three children together and they had a lot of success together owning nightclubs and bars throughout New York. So she's a self-made millionaire. She's had a lot of success as an entrepreneur and she's had a lot of success as a record producer. Sylvia passed away on September 29th, 2011. She died of heart failure at the age of 76. And she's one of the pioneers in the history of black music. And I don't think she gets the accolades that she deserves. She should be in the Hall of Fame. The Grammy Award should give her a Lifetime Achievement Award for being one of the pioneers in the history of music. A lot of people have different opinions about this topic. Leave a comment, rate, and subscribe.